I just got up after sleeping in today and this is the first thing I see. This is my basket of fiber and uh, it's not supposed to look like that. Thank you, Loki. So it's, I just got up. I already said that. Um, I slept in today and my husband took care of the kid and did everything. And uh, I spent, I spent a lot of time last night knitting on this project, which is the re-knit of one of my designs from 10 years ago. And this is the beginning of round here between the cables. And then the pattern repeat looks like this. You have the first cable then this lace, then the bobble section here, more lace, and then another cable that twists in the other way. And here is second marker, and this re just repeats once around. It is a, I think, personally, it's an easy pattern to knit. It's also a pattern that's a bit challenging at the same time, because you have a lot of different stitches. So if you're new to doing specialty stuff, this might be a perfect pattern for you because you're doing cables, some simple lace work, twisted traveling stitches, bobbles. It has a lot to go for it. And I really love how this looks. So what I'm using here is a skein of Soft Donegal from Studio Donegal. Um, that was hand dyed, it's a super duper special one-off, but the, um, the yarn itself, the Soft Donegal, comes in a gigantic range of colors, and I'm using it with a skein of mohair from Drops. And this is the nicest thing. But my pattern <laughs> looks like this. I have, you know, I've done a lot of scribbling in already, and uh, it didn't explain stuff, so yeah, eh, it doesn't matter. It's gonna get makeover, and I'm really liking it, you know? It's also one of those cowls that is actually next to your neck and not a mile away, which some cowls are, and they look pretty, but they are not very functional, in my opinion, so this one will be functional. And, oh yeah, coffee. So I'm gonna have coffee now. I'm gonna have to go upstairs and edit a few videos. The snow is back. This is how much snow we got overnight. This is my garden right now. And I'm off for a walk again. I mean, it was pretty two days ago. This is even prettier. I just love snow so much. And now I'm gonna walk up there and then up here and a bit further up to the bench. I have decided not to walk to that bench up there because no one's walked there before today. I wanted to go to that bench over here and I reached the end of the place where someone else has walked before me. <laughs> so now we're gonna go through the deep snow, make our own little <clears throat> walkway thing. But yeah, snow is just so, so pretty. <laughs> Sitting down is out of the question, which is okay. I wanted to spin a bit, but I think I don't know. I think I might just do that when I come back home and spin in my garden. <clears throat> and now I'll just enjoy the view for a bit. I don't I don't know. Also, good morning. <laughs> I haven't shown my face yet today. Um, I'm out and about for a walk up there. There's the pavilion. I can't really go up there because it's too steep. But I'm here. I'm enjoying the scenery. Clear blue skies, snow everywhere. And it's just so gorgeous out. I had to, I just had to go for a walk. I have reached my destination under these old wild apple trees here. 
and just wanted to talk to you a little bit about snow. So here's my, the only one who walked here. <laughs> um, here, we distinguish about between two different types of snow. I'm sure that peoples who live in more snowy areas distinguish between many, many more. But here, we do two different types. The first type is powdered snow, which is what we have today. It's super light and fluffy and airy and, you know, it's like a powder cloud. It's a perfect snow for skiing. And the other type of snow is a very heavy and wet snow that's perfect for building snowmen, doing snowball fights. But this time we have powdered snow and it's gorgeous. The blue of the sky and the white of the snow and oh, I'm so happy right now to be here. <laughs> and I think I will get up my spindle after all and do a bit of spinning. I just wanted to show you one more thing up there. Can you see right above my finger? That's the bench where I usually walk to and I decided not to today. Uh, yeah. done the first skein of this little spin is finished and he watched me spin the whole thing while out and about basically so um not during vlogmas but before as well and yeah i now get to take this off when i'm at home and i have to say i'm pretty um happy about this because this spindle is becoming so heavy that i don't enjoy spinning on it anymore and <laughs> um, i'm really glad that i I'm done with this now and I just hope that the other half or half of my fiber is the same amount of little fiber bumps and not one more which is my fear right now um, yeah we'll find out and now I think I'm gonna go back home and yeah get some other work done because you know I still have to do all the other things as well <laughs> I am in my um, sewing room slash office right now and I am going to edit some videos for Patreon. Um, I did bake some strudel this week. I made a savory one and I made apfelstrudel and I have two videos for Patreon that I have to edit and upload and get everything done. And I want to do that by the end of today because it takes quite a while for everything to you know, actually work. So I'm going to do that now. I'm going to have some breakfast because I should eat something now and then a bit later we are going to go out for lunch with Come on, come on.
Na komm. Komm. Jetzt komm rein. Komm bitte. Nein, doch. Komm rein. Nein, du kommst jetzt rein. Komm rein. Geh's mal. Komm. Doch. Komm rein. Day three advent things. Um, we're still in gray, and the candle says beautiful moments. And the color for today's inkvent is ash, so it's gray and gray, <laughs> which I'm fine with. And yeah, so day three, still gray, and I still have not started spinning, so I have to get going. That is it for today's video. I hope you have had a wonderful day i did i had a great day and i'm now going to edit the video and then i will finish my cowl i hope and probably seam together tim's sweater so that it's finished you know but yeah thank you so much for joining me on this journey every day and i will talk to you again tomorrow bye <laughs>